let me have... Um, so if somebody just grabs your wrist and tries to move on you, don't... You may have to take a little step back, but just start working your elbows, making... The, go ahead and just do this. Make a figure eight. Let your toes move. And what you don't want to do is you don't want to cross my center line. So cross my center line. I can get behind your elbow. If you... And even you want to stay an inch to the side of it. And when I say cross it, I mean use the line created by your upper arm so your elbow's pointing. So bring your elbow over a little more. And, and you see now you can pull down with your elbow and strike with your hand. Now what a lot of Wing Chun people do is they pivot on that elbow. See? Now just lift your elbow. Lift so you can stop me. Now, I'm going to do it again. I want you to lift your elbow again. Doesn't work. Do it again. See, I'm pivoting mid forearm. So I'm pulling. I'm pulling with my elbow. So go ahead. Tell you what, King, why don't you stand right over here? And Yeah, right, no, right over there. And everybody put your left arm out. Left arm. And with your other hand, back up just a little, Marcus. Yeah. Touch mid forearm. And then anchor, anchor your forearm of the pointing hand against your ribs so it doesn't move. And then just pivot on that spot you're touching. Yeah, so touch right there. And, and make a pretty solid contact. And see the figure eight going on there? See it? Yeah, so poke it right there and feel, see how you're pivoting mid forearm? So as much as your hand moves, your elbow moves. That's it. Here, here, wait. Feel it? Try to main try to stick to that spot. Feel it? See your see your breaking contact, and the reason you're breaking contact is you're pivoting over here at your elbow. See how you're not breaking contact now with your finger? Right. But you see see feel how your elbow's moving as much as your hand? See your the tendency is for your mind to go to your hand, but I want you to think about your elbow. Hold it, hold it. Good. Good. You want to see if King's in frame? <laughs> is he? No, don't, don't move it. Just everybody take a step this way. No, toward me. Yeah, well, that's good. Go back. Yeah, go back. Go this way. Go this way. Okay, what I want you to do now... Touch that spot again. And pivot on that spot. So you'll be essentially be pulling down with your elbow. That's it. Or just And then just... just notice how... I'm pulling you into that strike. Feel it? That's what I want to feel. And then, and then let it let it land. Go ahead and make a chop, a chopping hand. That's it. Good. Wait a second. So just pivot on that spot. That's it. And go ahead and hit me a little harder. I want it to pick up on the microphone. Really hit it. Good. And what you would do after this? Do it again. Because the tendency is to want to hit the face, and maybe your arm isn't long enough. So you hit whatever you can hit, and then chop up against my jaw. And then ginger fist to the gut with that hand. No. Make a ginger fist, and drive it in. And let this go, and then come back with that elbow. That's it. So you're going to do this. 
And you're going to do that. Well, you're going to do this, that, this. And you might have to step in if the person's moving away. And yeah, that's it. Don't put so much emphasis on the elbow. I mean, you're going to do the pull and then hit. And then up. Now you say you're pushing me away. Go, go to a downward angle. That's it. Bang. There it is. Yeah, try not to lean. Try not to lean. Good. Try to hit with the edge of your hand. Good. And then go up to my head. Ginger fist. Drive it down. Drive it down. See how that winds? There you go. Very good. Yeah, do it again. Try not to lean, though. Just pivot on that spot. Go ahead. Drive it up. Drive it down. That's it. Good. Go ahead. Why don't you do king? Yeah, try not to lean, though. Now, Marcus, remember this phrase. Let me show you how I want it done. So you feel, see how I'm pulling you into the hit? Right. So it's, and then after that, you go up, you go down, there. So relax, relax. Okay, see how you're sort of leaning into it there? Just, just. Good. And then, I, I, yeah, I we'll just, steps. we'll work on this one. Good. And then up, ginger fist, drive it in, that's it. Now, here's a drill. Let's do this drill. Hold your forearms out. And you're just going to get used to rolling and doing this figure eight movement. And then you're going to get here with your forearm horizontal. You're going to look at the middle, mid forearm, and pivot on this spot. So you're pulling with that elbow. We call it, single sticking hands is called Don Chi Sao, single sticking hands. So we've named this Don Lop Sao. Lop Sao means grabbing hand. Sure. This is a grabbing elbow. So it's a single arm grabbing elbow. Sao can mean hand or arm. So put your arms out. And you do this with the, you do the technique with the hand on top. Because this one's obviously has to maneuver to get out. So just, just do a few figure eights like that, just to get the motion. And stop on the next one. Stop on this one. Hold it right there. Don't, don't do the technique. Don't, don't, King, don't, don't go right into the technique. Stop with your forearm horizontal and look at that center spot and pivot on that spot. OK, but you're pulling down with your whole arm. You just want to pivot on that spot. Now you're pivoting on your elbow. I don't understand how you okay. pivot. Okay. Well, do what you did. See, I can get out of that because you're pivoting at your elbow. Okay. You want to pivot here. If you pivot here, your elbow goes down. So if I go. But you see, you're you're moving your whole arm, and that that can work. But notice how I'm as I'm pulling with my elbow, I'm hitting with my hand. See it? Right. So you want to, as you pull down with your elbow, and what will really help is just thinking about a steel bar is going through your forearm, and you're just, as much as you're, if you're pivoting on this spot, as much as your elbow goes down, your hand comes forward. It almost seems like you're moving your yeah, but don't, you're doing it okay. Just don't lean. See how you're, see how you're, you're sort of leaning into it. Don't right. don't do that. That's it. 
just yeah good here let me trade places ah very good very good yeah let me take her first so just hold that arm out tell you what put both hands there bend your thumbs and just do this and then stop right here Look at your mid forearm and go ahead and just do the technique. Good. Try not to lean, though. Try not to lean. And let it hit. Let it land. Good. Good. So it's. Good. And then up. And down. When you, when you do this one, let your body wind up, and that's it. Very good. I'm afraid of her. Hard not. Good. Excellent. That's it. Very good. Let me switch places. So now try try not to have your hand arms too your elbows too wide. Try to keep them fairly tight. That's it. That's it. That's it. Uh, the other one. The other one. So the other one? Yeah, drive this one in. And then when you do drive this one in, see, it winds that one up. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I was going to say something over there. Yeah, try to have your elbows closer in. There you go. Yeah, so try to try to really get this coordinated between your elbow and the strike. See? So go ahead and just pivot on that spot. That's it. Do it again. Let's do this one. And straighten up. Yeah, it's okay if you slip off. But hit me harder. So see how I'm pulling you in and hitting you away. Hit me harder. Good. Good. Now decrease the space between the two movements. So it's more of a... Good. That was pretty good. Good, good. Good. Now, if somebody grabs you and starts shoving you back, you just start wiggling those elbows. There you go. That's it. That's it. Good. Excellent. So, let, let me do this. So, if I grab you like this, and start, you just start wiggling those elbows and break one free. That's it. That's it. Good. Excellent. So, just remember, if somebody really gets in on you, just start working those elbows and break, break out with one, break out with both. We got a cushion at home. We could try that what? You got like an extra cushion. Oh. Yeah. 